Good morning. It is Saturday and we're having a bit of a different day today. Here's a clue. Ooh, what is going on? It's a pandemic. How can there be a suitcase on my bed? So right now in the UK, nobody is allowed to go anywhere pretty much, but single adult households are allowed to form a support bubble with another single adult household. So of course, naturally, that is what I am doing with my boyfriend. All the time that this has been possible, he's come here rather than us go to him because for us to get to him, it's public transport either way. And obviously that's a bit risky or it involves him having to pick us up go there and drop us back again. But we are going this weekend. He stayed here last night, then we're gonna go back with him and then in a couple of days time, we'll come back together and he'll stay here again and so on and so forth. So he hasn't had to go out of his way to collect us. It's just sort of fitted in with his routine. So this is what we're gonna do. And I'm packing. And in other news, I think we're gonna get a bit of snowy footage today on the drive to IB's. It is a long time since I've been in a car. I'm actually excited to go for a drive. And now normally I spend so much time in cars and trains and buses that I'm sick of it, but not at the moment, understandably. I think the last time I went in a car was when Izzy was going to a Sunday group and IB and I took a walk around Cardiff Bay and Cardiff Bay Barrage. I'll link that video at the end in case you are interested. I think that was the last time I went in a car and that's quite a few months ago now. Anyway, Izzy and I are packing. We're literally only going for a couple of days, but we have nothing at IB's anymore because he brought it all back to us because we hadn't been there for so long. So I've basically got a pair of pajamas, some underwear, some socks. There's like more than, there's double I need because I'll just probably leave a couple there in case we do it again. I've packed a bit of conditioner. This is literally all we have left. We need more anyway. That's left over from my hair dyeing because he doesn't have conditioner and Izzy and I, you know, with fuss pots. I got some moisturizer, masks for me and Izzy because I don't know if she's packed any, but I've put some. Um, an extra warm, fluffy layer, a spare pair of jeans in case I get muddy on a walk and Izzy's hairspray or I might nick a bit from a fringe because it gets a bit unruly. And also I am packing Tech Alert, my multi-way which is usb so on here i have one iphone charger which is a lightning charger i honestly can't remember what this is called this type of adapter but i've got two of those because i need them for various things and also a micro usb which i need for various things and there's a spare phone charger lead there because often I, well i've got two at the moment <laughs> um and there's izzy's um rice cakes because i can't live without um charger for my laptop can't do without that. Headphones, because I edit with headphones. The first rough cut I do with headphones, so I know it's okay for the headphones users. And then when I do the next cut, refining further, I do it without headphones so that I know it's okay for non-headphone users. And I've covered both bases then. My flute, of course, a flute cleaner, reading glasses, diary, a micro SD converter for putting my footage from my GoPro onto the laptop. This is a battery charger for the batteries, which come with this camera vlogging light, Oop. just in case uh, can't get good lighting. Charger for, oh, spare battery for the vlogging light and the charger that goes with the vlogging light. Laptop, laptop case, and some lined paper. Also a mouse to go with the laptop. And I know it probably seems silly, I've got a great big bag, but this is my rucksack and everything goes in its place in my rucksack. It's my traveling companion, you know, it's like my office from home. I know exactly where everything slots in so I can find it instantly. So I will be putting the things that normally go in the rucksack in the rucksack. And I better get on and do that now. And one more thing I just thought of, the second quick release plate, because IB's got a lovely big chunky tripod, which is better than mine. So I might use it while I'm there interchangeably with this one. And two more things just shoved in, uh, an umbrella each for me and Izzy, because we might want to go out and it's really forecast for heavy rain tomorrow. Oh, I just run up from the cellar, flute stand, that packs down smaller, mini tripod for the GoPro and the little thingy for clipping it on. There, that's all done and taken downstairs. Uh, I'm going to pack Cammy now. Cammy doesn't have his own case. Cammy as in camera, that's my affectionate name for it. He doesn't have his own case, but I put him in this massive sort of shoulder bag and it's really convenient to just undo the zip and whip it straight out all set up. So because nice and spacious in there. So that's my solution to that when I'm vlogging on the go. All right, I'll see you on the road. Oh, it's my fancy camera's first outing in IB's car. Look at that steady footage. <laughs> Look at all that snow up there. Oh, wow. In the back, we've got an Izzy who is chowing down on Kentucky Fried Chicken from a takeaway portal hatch. 
we were all gonna have something, but they had nothing vegan and they had nothing vegetarian and they had nothing pescatarian. So we're gonna call in somewhere else, aren't we, Ivy, for the grown-ups portion. Look, there's IB's mask hanging up there on his steering wheel column. No, it's not, is it? It's on the thingy. I can't film it there. Okay. Anyway, indicator. You can tell it's a pandemic car. There's another one by there. Sanitizer by there. He's got his dead old wipes. Look. There are also a whole box full of masks. By there. Oh, and gloves as well. He's very well equipped for his work, presumably, isn't it, love? Well, I wondered if it would feel strange sitting in the car again after all this time, but it doesn't. It just feels completely normal. It's minus two degrees, as you can see. There's still a load of snow on the bonnet there. You can have dessert if you want. I was going to do KFC unless I'm... Uh, we might end up in ones. McDonald's if they still haven't got anything veggie. There's the KFC. I think they'll, do, um, they'll do some kind of similar dessert in KFC. Dessert? Oh, you're talking to Izzy? Yeah. No, I don't need to dessert. I don't no, think no, I don't no, want right. anything because I still haven't finished my chicken. We're in Mercer, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Mercer, lovely Mercer. Don't you know you're a dream? Do 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 since he was very, very little, and we were killing time one time when she was at class, and I think I had a salad. They still do do the same. I kind of want something I can pick up and eat in the car, really, rather than a, a bitty salad. KFC is extremely filling. Oh, that, i.e. you couldn't finish it? Yeah, but like, the chicken. I might have well, it says they've got the vegan thing, look. Okay, I might have that thing. But I'm going to go for the vegan one, if you don't mind. No. So I want to try it. Uh, do you want a drink or is it? Nah. nah. We'll be back at yours before we know it, won't we? About 25 minutes. 25 minutes, yeah, I can hold on. So, do you want chips? Vegan burger and chips? I oh, guess, thank you. Well, I think it's maybe cheaper. Right, what would I go out here? Oh, yeah. Can I have a vegan burger and chips? One more drink. Have we got anything that's closed up that we haven't got a drink straight away? I'll have coffee, actually. Hey. I'll have a coffee with it. Anything else? Yeah, I'll have. Boneless chicken and chips. Three strips or four strips? I'll have four, please. And more drink? Have you got like oh Pepsi Max, I do. Anything else? No, that's it. No, you're then, please. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. Oh, look at that ice going down there. It's on the move. Oh, if it goes, that reminds me of Ireland. Does that thing look like Ireland? Would you move the car back to Yeah, where, whereabouts? Down there. Oh yeah, I see. That. Oh, some stuff has come. My yeah. coffee and Ivy's Coke. Dim parkia. Yeah. Oh, we have to wait by here while they bring it out to me. I think so. I've just realised where we are. I have vlogged in this place before. I, me and Izzy went to that McDonald's over there ages ago and it was in the... Oh, <laughs> it's not going in focus because of the windscreen. Oh yeah, thank you. <laughs> but we did, we went to that McDonald's over there and had like, I can't remember what we had. What Probably on a hospital day. Oh, you haven't got fixed, you No, know? oh, never mind, okay. I'm not that angry anyway, it's fine. I'll just have a burger. Yes, that's Trago Mills there. We, uh, we're in Cavartha oh, Retail yeah. Park. Oh, blimey. Oh, yeah. I have nowhere to put my drink. I just have to stay there. Oh, oh, yeah. Right, here is the vegan burger. I'd better have a munch and let you know how it is. It looks like there's just lettuce in with it and some mayo. Mmm, it's different to any other veggie burger I've ever had because it tastes like fake chicken, which I suppose would make sense coming from a KFC. Is it good? It is good, and it's got a, got a bit of an afterburn, a bit of a chilli. Maybe not chilli, maybe maybe more pepper than chilli. But there's an afterburn which I like, Isabel would not like, I can tell you that now. That is good. Do you want one of these, mm. Is? Do you want one of the chickens? Mm -hmm. I would have this again. This is okay. definitely nicer than, Let's like, 
to McDonald's. I'm probably more salad mine, there's only a bit of um, puny lettuce. Yeah, so it's like a fake chicken burger basically. Really good. Mmm. We're on our way again, looking out at the snowy landscape. We are now at IB's and guess what? He said we can do a house tour video. I won't do it in this one. I'll do it as a separate video though because I think it's gonna to be too long if I put it in this one. Izzy went straight out for a walk. The second we got here, she's like, I wanna walk somewhere different. She was out off on her own. Uh, IB is sorting out bedding. Well, I'm supposed to be helping him actually. I'm waiting for him to call me and he hasn't, but I think I'll just go up. He's been just putting the hoover around quickly. Sorting Izzy's room out as well, just to, for her to stay in for the next few days. My mum has rung as well. I need to get online and just update her online shop that's coming for her tomorrow. Leave it vlogging somewhere other than my house. It's amazing. <laughs> so we left our home in snow, and here it is snowing, but there's not very much settling, is there? I don't know if we'll fit a walking, so I need to ring my mum, and it's going to get dark pretty soon after that. But uh, we'll see. What time is it going to get dark, love? What do you reckon? Uh, at about five thirty. So dark by. Oh, well, we might get walking then, yeah. after I ring my mum. I could do a sooner rather than later. She's She was just literally getting her lunch on. She literally just put an egg in the pan when I rang her, so. She rang, left a message, and then I rang back, and by that point she'd given up and started to get her lunch on, so that's that's what happened there. I've just come into Isabel's room here. I'm just quickly filming it before she messes it up and doesn't want me to film in it. <laughs> Whoops. She did have a chance to swap rooms, actually, this time to one with a double bed, but she's chosen to stick to this one because she likes it, she's familiar with it, and she likes the posters. So, yeah. IB's just put a heater on because it's a bit chilly in here. He's had the heating on constant, but only very low. Oh, I'm just looking at a big flurry of snowflakes. I hope it settles. Be fun, but we can still see plain lawn out of the back window. A little bit of snow down there, look, but uh, not much to speak of, really. We're just making Izzy's bed up. What she likes to do is lie on top of a duvet and then have a lovely blanket. And then she snuggles under the blanket and that's all she has. I think with her eczema, she's just always wanted to be a bit cooler at night. And I was going to tell you that the snow's coming down a bit heavier, but the second I turned the camera on it, it stopped. <laughs> it's still coming down though. Some big flurries. Oh, I just had a big waft from a blanket. It's a bit, uh... She loves this blanket. Is it need doubling up, I think, does that? I don't know, she'll do what she will with it, I dare say. There we are, all done. There's an extra pillow for her, so she'll be extra snuggly. IB is hoovering in that bedroom. And uh, I'm going to do the bedding in this one. And the bedding's in there at the moment. So Izzy turned her nose up at this one. <laughs> sheets they never seem to fit <laughs> there's a problem with their name because they're always a little bit too tight in my experience I think they shrink in the tumble dryer What did you get up to, babes? Um, I just kind of trotted around, lived my best life. There was like nobody out there, so I kind of stabbed at the ice with a stick a bit. You're saying the canal was frozen over, Yeah, it looks like milk, because there's snow on it. Hopefully me and Ivy will get to see that. I'm just going to sort mum out, and um, then hopefully we can go out. But Iceland are coming with a big shopping delivery any time after five, so we have to be back in time for that. Your makeup's looking very nice. Let's see, it's coordinated. Can you shut your eyes so you can see? Okay, I'll shut the wire. Okay. Oh, very pretty. Goes nicely with the cardi. 
Mm. I'm just about set up now. I've got my laptop on, ready to ring my mum and sort the online shop out, make sure she's got everything she needs. And I've put all the things I sort of need straight away in the top drawer for me editing. Oh, pencil case. Yeah, I didn't tell you about the pencil case, but the pencil case lives in here, you see. Uh, so, yes, let's get that. So it's all my pencils and pens in there, taking notes. Well, I've just um, put the footage in for today's vlog and I found out that I've got quite a lot ready. So I'm gonna do something I don't usually do because you know, it's a bit of an unusual one. I've got a bit more to film than usual. I'm gonna finish off today's vlog in the next vlog. But if you have enjoyed watching this one, please give it a like. Oh, sorry about the hats. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a like. It really helps the channel to grow. I so appreciate it. And if you're new here and you'd like to follow more of our story, um, <laughs> <laughs> hit the subscribe button and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.